it's Suzanne from The Painted Drawer and today I am doing a quick video. It's actually part two of this um, mid-century modern chair makeover. So I'll put a link um, to the first video um, up here as well as underneath in the uh, information box. But in that video basically I took the chair, I found it in a dumpster at the thrift store, I sanded it back and um, basically got it to this point where it's in great condition. Um, in doing so, I had to remove the old uh, straps that were here that keep the cushion down. So today I am going to quickly stain the chair. I was actually going to keep it natural color, but now I'm staining it um, with General Finishes Java Gel Stain. I was going to do a darker stain to match my son's uh, bedroom furniture because that's where this chair is going. And I'm going to use <laughs> Gorilla Tape. It's basically black duct tape and I'm going to see if I can work that to make webbing for the seat covers which I purchased the foam at Walmart and I'll show you that at the very end. So let's get started. Okay so now this is where it can get kind of messy. I'm using um, like I said the general finishes Java Gel Stain. I've got gloves on. Um, I don't have a whole lot left in my little tin so let's see how this goes. Uh, basically you take the gel stain like so. And there you go. Rub it into the bare wood. This is a, a solid wood chair. It's really a good looking piece of furniture. And I knew that it was going to turn out really nicely when I saw it. So let's just have some fun. Okay, so the staining is done and it really soaked right in beautifully. I'm just going to let this dry and then apply a quick wipe on polyurethane coat. And when I'm done with that, I will try to use the, um, I don't know where it went right now, here we go, the tape uh, to make the straps that go underneath the seat cushion. <laughs> 